Hi guys, welcome to our home. <laughs> Okay, so that was a bit of the soft launch because squirmy wormy here really wanted your attention. <laughs> but come on in. First of all, I want to actually have you pan to the other side. Scotty's behind the lens here. And this place was originally Scotty's before it was ours. But if something you can notice, because if you've been following my channel for some time, you'll know that I absolutely love painting my door and you would have seen a really beautiful pink color there. But this is the entrance of our home. Scotty and I have redone all of this carpet. Um, we also redid the banister and I'm using the royal there and I think you would agree there, Scotty, the royal we. I had no part in this. <laughs> yeah. And then we added a new light, which sorry guys, like we can't dim. That's like a problem. We also got this gorgeous artwork by Chris Sinclair. We'll put a picture of him here. You probably recognize him as Canada's number one weatherman for the Weather Network. And then across here, crazy ladder, adjusted it on the stairs, laid out all of these frames on the ground, and we ended up doing this gallery wall. So these frames are from Ikea. You can get those, those are the biggest ones. I think it's 90 by something. And then I got this one, and this one, and that one also from Ikea, and then these two are from Michaels. So highly recommend. But this artwork is from Decenio or Opposite Wall. I highly recommend both of those places to get artwork. Amazing, they have so many prints, but give yourself a ton of time because you're gonna be looking on that um, website for a very long time. But Scotty, I think that it's time that both of us show them the kitchen. What do you think? Let's do it. Okay, should we just pan over or? Yeah, I was just gonna pan. <laughs> okay, I feel bad that you're not in it. Do you feel bad? I feel bad that I feel like you're out of breath. You're just like flying <laughs> through it. <laughs> okay. Actually, I'm gonna take the camera from you because I think that you need to talk about the chalk wall. Sure. Cool? Okay. You're gonna have to adjust the exposure on the fly, by the way. Okay, let's adjust the exposure. When I first came in, this is a beautiful, just like bare wall. Yeah. When I bought this place, like in 2015, no one had really done anything with it. So I had always wanted a chalk wall ever since becoming a young adult and wanting to still be a child at heart. So I got this chalk wall and I used to have whenever someone came over, they would just scribble something they would add to it. So Give us some notable mentions. My dad did John Lennon the Imagine. Um, my friend Nick and his partner at the time did this. Um, my mom did or suggested that quote but wanted me to write it. Be <laughs> silly, be honest, be kind. Um, Isn't this one yours? Yeah, and keep I did your keep your shit together. together. Um, this says shoot or shoot, because when I was about to date Amanda, Ooh. I was like, listen, I gotta take my shot. I think she likes me. I gotta <laughs> see if she'll uh, go out with me. And then I wrote, no, you wrote this, but I wrote it's fine, because that's from one of our very first skits together. Yeah. Um, which I will link down below if you want to see. It's actually really funny. And and then some and then some is from an Arkell song that we really, really liked, because we went to Arkell's concerts together. When I was like, Before does this guy dating, like me? And after dating. This is our kitchen. This is called a fridge. It keeps things cold. What's the best thing that you could grab out of the fridge at any moment? At any moment? Not right now, because I know that there's not much in our fridge, but if you were like hangry in the middle of the day and you were grabbing a snack, what would you have in your fridge, Scotty? Oh my gosh, I don't know. I would have, we love like a good like turkey deli meat. That's like our go-to like snack. Yeah, just but a couple thing, slices keep you going. The thing I grab most every time is either cream for my coffee or <laughs> copious amounts of water from these water bottles. Um, this is our kitchen. This is a wonderful gas stove that we had put in um, with shouts to Robbie Weldon. And what was his friend's Honestly, name? my best friend, Russell, who also gave yes. us all of these appliances. We also had that custom installed along with this, which was great. Something like my pride and joy that my dad and I did. Can I grab it? Yeah, and then we'll trade as well. This used to be just like your classic dishwasher, but I always thought, how do you put on like a custom facing onto this dishwasher? Ooh. So my dad and I figured it out. It was great. It was a really fun project. I have all of this video footage that I've never edited together. Yeah. But so this is from Ikea and this is just like a cabinet that we custom put on top of it. I'm yeah. sorry being a terrible cameraman. I'm like, don't make them ill. They will unsubscribe <laughs> for illness. Something else we adore in this kitchen, obviously, is like our coffee nook with like all our mugs. But then as well, this whole place is hooked up with hue lights. Yeah, so if it's buzzing a little bit, that's maybe from the hue. Can I go into some of the renos that we've done in here? Sure. Okay, so me and my dad, job well done. That is what we go by, HGTV, by the series. We are ready, we are willing, he is yeah. almost retired. Channel pending, season yeah. to come. So, 
we purchased these tiles. They're actually vinyl tiles from Eden Tile. And we purchased so much that we wanted to do in the kitchen and one bathroom. But guys, they will usually oversell you on those tiles. And if you have someone who is as good as math at Robbie Weldon, you're gonna be able to do two bathrooms for the price of one. So I'll show you that soon, but we ended up doing this click tile. Pretty awesome, quick tip, when you're going behind the stove or even behind the fridge, you're never gonna see that. You're gonna see some tiles there. We also got this beautiful mat because Wendy Micklejohn, Scotty's mom, suggested it. It's from this brand, Hydraulic. <laughs> I think, what does it say? I have no idea. Oh God, I it think looks it, much more white than I think it appears it's Scandinavian. in this lighting. Let's just bump up that exposure. I managed to take all of these doors off. The kitchen was originally like a honey oak and they got one spray, I think, with white. And then so I ended up taking all these off and repainting them and changing the hardware from kind of like an old country silver to these ones. I ended up purchasing these. Ooh, I'm trying to remember. I think it was Rona. Rona got those. Rona or Lowe's, yeah. And then dad and I also did the subway tile. I'll link up above our subway tile video because I've heard from multiple comments that it's actually very helpful. And quick fun fact, this shelf we had to take down completely and we ended up replacing it with, you can purchase a shelf. It literally is just like shelf um, in Lowe's. And we had to shave off this much, this much <laughs> to get it to fit in there, which is incredible. And when we didn't have it there, Scott, you can attest, this was like one of the biggest things we missed. Every day I would come here and go. And go, oh, oh, oh God. Where are my mugs? But besides that, yeah, we, um, we love our kitchen and it's had a really good amount of storage, but feel like maybe some more things we could like label and things. Hey. Yeah? Let's go to the bedroom. Okay. Oh. Wait. Go. Oh my gosh. We forgot. We forgot about another job well done because <laughs> me and my dad literally we did this entire kitchen other than just the countertop. But you'll notice here, this used to be like the flimsiest little board on top of this thing. And my dad and I added this paneling and it's so crazy. Another thing that we're like, wow, horseshoes live somewhere in our body and I won't suggest where, but they do. Um, because these panels kind of come in a little section of two and they're click, what is that called? Tongue and groove. So they go like that together. And this last one, we didn't have to cut any of these horizontally. This is how many there were and it fit that well. And then um, Rosie's little house is here, but we also have them going all the way down here. And when Rosie's crate's not there, it, it looks really, really gorgeous. I, I do say so myself. This is where I work. That's where Rosie works. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, she's sniffing for treats because if you're curious about where we keep them, they're up there. Last but not least, this space. Normally we have like our huge light. We also used to have um, photo rolls. So we had a white one and a pink one and we had high hopes to get other colors, but the money went somewhere else. I don't know, we'd hope to get some more someday. So we had a photo roll thing there. We ended up taking it down just to kind of like elongate the wall and we weren't using it um, enough. And then we have a huge light that usually goes here and in here is just like our hot water heater. It's kind of like where we keep our vacuum. And then sorry if these lights are buzzing on camera, but these are Philips Hue Playlight play bars. Um, you can change these to any color. I think, I believe it's like over 16,000 colors if you have the bridge for Hue Light. And if you don't have the bridge, there's 16 different options. And then this is just our little Ikea. I think this is a Malm. This is a Malm? I don't know. <laughs> Sounds right. Anyways, yeah, we've got our records here, record player. This is where we keep our microwave so we don't have to keep it on there so we have more counter space. And then Scotty and I almost destroyed ourselves hanging these, but they're up and we like them. Because we were using a drill with one setting, which was tur yeah. turbo. They make them better now, kids. Yeah, yeah. Okay, bedroom or main room? Let's go bedroom. Okay. okay, so this is one thing that I'm actually super proud of is changing the frames <laughs> down the hallway. This is one of my favorite photos of Rosie. She's an adventure pup. And then this is one of my favorite Ooh, photos of Scotty. Ooh, you can show that bathroom, yeah? Sure, I've done nothing, but yeah. Um, and it took us a really long time to get photos in those frames, which I'm proud of, um, because it was just like the photo that was in the frame. This is commonly referred to as Amanda's bathroom. Yeah. <laughs> Please don't open the drawers. <laughs> uh, you won't be impressed. <laughs> you've seen a reno of this. 
It's really good. The floor is in. Floor is the same from the kitchen. This just happened too. It's gorgeous. We love this mirror from Ikea. Amanda had this at her apartment in Hamilton. Um, and we just knew we needed the same thing. Beautiful light. Amanda hung this herself. It's great. One sec, one sec. Okay, if you're curious, this light, I'm just taking down the ISO. This light's from CB2. It also comes in a black, and I will link that down in the description. And this mirror is only, I believe, $90. It's so good. And it's so good because it also has this little shelf here, which I'll often just, often just pop my iPad. And then when I'm washing my face, it's like the most amazing thing. And then this little, doodad is called the good morgan don't open that <laughs> good morning <laughs> don't open that <laughs> i got some organizing to do but Oops. if you did open it you would know that there's a huge cavity in there with tons and tons of stuff tons of storage but me and mr mickle john john mickle john a different kind of job well done I a john mickle john this well is like done. a team effort though this is Truly. both your dad and then my dad my dad helped me install this do the piping and then johnny boy helped me put on these because when you buy an Ikea product, especially a cabinet, oh man, sorry about this lighting guys. When you buy a cabinet, don't put on their hardware, just buy other hardware because they don't have pre-drilled holes. So you can put whatever you want on there and it will look custom. This is our bathtub, which Amanda wishes was much deeper. Here's where our washer dryer is. This used to be one unit, like a classic, like one, like the washer and then dryer. My dad and I had to move it down those stairs that we originally showed you. You thought he was going to die. I thought it was about to fall on him at one point. It was a uh, stressful point. Also throwing it out, I was pushing it into the dumpster at the dump and uh, I felt something tweak in my bag that oh, was no. never tweaked before. It was very alarming. I was okay. <laughs> no. But yeah, it's just hidden behind here, which we love. We'll say this plant is from Ikea. That little shelving unit is from HomeSense. Scotty and I absolutely love having our JBL little speaker in here because waterproof. Shout out to Re Recharge. It's waterproof and we can listen to music or YouTube videos when we have a shower. So I asked Amanda to move in. Fortunately, she said yes. Amanda Ann Wallen, I, Scott Thomas Micklejohn, on this date, your 28th name day, ask you to move in with me at my home south of the orchard in Burlington, Ontario. I wish to make this our home and eagerly await your response. Happy birthday. I love you, Scotty. And she wow. said yes. <laughs> Multiple times I've said it. yes to you. Also, the shower curtain is from HomeSense. Moving on. Speaking of showers. Let's be showered in dappled sunlight from the wow. afternoon. So this is the entrance to our spare room. Also, I want to shout out this rug that I completely overpaid for, but it is gorgeous. But they saw a young, impressionable woman and they were like, you know what? We're going to charge her. <laughs> oh, wow. So I will we have our therapy sessions. <laughs> I'll often creep in here and see Rosie. Hi, girl. Rose. Oh, there we go. Look who's outside. And she will go. This is where Rosie will stare into the parking lot and look for her friends. <laughs> <laughs> look for her friends, me, Scotty, or Lynn, or anyone else who's putting out their trash. We've hung our guitar here. And then inside of this room, this is probably the room that you guys are the most familiar with just from my videos. But you'll know that I did the sticker wall, hung all the paintings. My parents both helped me do this mirror, put that up. My mom was like such a superstar. So my dad helped me hang this bar because we hated the doors in front of the closet. She helped me um, cut these curtains so that they would fit perfectly over top of the closet. And the cool part is, I don't know if I can do it right now, but oh, I actually adjusted it so you can't. But at it the can moment. go all the way over, which like really blocks off the space, like softens the sound if you're doing a podcast. It's really cool. Really, really neat. Can you take this and I'll just show a couple of really quick things? Sure. Don't be sick. Okay, yeah, so this is my closet. And uh, dad, I can't believe how much stuff we've done in this place. It's insane. My dad helped me hang this bar so that it would be a bit stronger and I could put more clothes on there. And then we also did a half bar because that way I was able to hang dresses and long pants and just coats and things like that. And then we kept the shelving up there. Um, and then I got some little organizers from Walmart. I will also link those down below because they are amazing. I purchased this from Wayfair. It's my little clothing rack. And you guys will have seen this in so many different videos. And that is just when I'm, you know, planning a styling video or anything like that. Love to have that here. <laughs> this box is full of wine that <laughs> Scotty and I don't know who sent to us. So we have not drank. <laughs> We're like, who's trying to kill us? But it is the perfect box to put a little throw on and Rosie can stare out the window. Besides that, in here, I purchased this beautiful lamp from West Elm. Our couch is from Structube. This is from Anthropology. This pillow is from 
a Pottery Barn, and then I'm not sure where those baskets came from. This was just from PR. Scotty bought me these beautiful flowers for hitting 25K on YouTube, so be sure to subscribe if you have not already, because your girl wants a 30K flower bundle, and <laughs> this, <laughs> <laughs> you're just laughing at yourself and this chest of drawers is from Structube and you will see the same side tables in our bedroom and then of course we have our nano leaf which was most recently set up and a lot of these bits and bobs Majuri jewelry box I got this from my friend pastiche she her name's not pastiche but that's what her shop is called but I'll link her shop down below too because she has the most amazing beautiful source things and then just some like home sense things my fragrances etc so that was a quick word bomb do you want to do our bedroom or your office area? Let's do the office. Okay, great. Okay, so to get to Scotty's office, we've got to do the main room. So I'll take that and then give the camera back or switch the camera. Scotty can have it explain his office. Anyways, we got a Peloton during the pandemic. We did have it turned this way at one point. So Scott would be like sitting on the couch and I would be like Spice Girls riding. I would be like, spice up your life, and just hating the fact that he was staring at me during that <laughs> process. On the big screen, what we will do is Scotty will put on the hockey game and I will put on like a walking tour in Italy and just manifest my dreams of having a beach bod while being on the Peloton. It's very motivating. On this side, we've got our little bookcase. I think, Scotty, you had that. Is that matching your billy over there? Yeah. Yeah, okay. And then Scotty bought this fireplace, but the funny thing about this is when I first met Scotty before we were dating, when we were still working together, I had just moved into my loft and I was like, oh, I really want this fireplace. I don't know if you remember this, Scotty, but then you ended up getting it. And I was like, this was his first move. <laughs> he was like, this girl's gonna fall in love with me because I have a fireplace she wants. I'm nesting for her. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is my Not way that of, I really this wanted is that my fireplace way of too. <laughs> um, and this is uh, my bar cart that you also should know if you followed my loft video. I purchased this and drove very unfortunately with it in the front while driving standard, but I got it home. I just knew I wanted it. Poofs are from Simon's. This was from HomeSense. This is from Winners in States. I also got that lantern from I don't know where. We've got Middleton, our pride and joy. The counterpart to Pippa, RIP. But we also have Lark, who we most recently turned. She was like this, because she was being supported by the window. But guys, turn your fiddles they will start to straighten out and Lark is doing a fabulous job. We also have probably the one and only time Rosie's toys are all in her bin because this isn't actually how we live. They're usually everywhere. And now it's time for Scotty to start with Rosie's Nook and take us to his office. Oh, wow. Yeah. I was gonna say, what are your favorite PlayStation games? Oh, um, and that's where, oh, and this is actually pretty cool. My dad built us this little thing to put under the bar cart because that's where we have our Wi-Fi and Scotty's like PlayStation things. Hi, this is Rosie's Nook. <laughs> Rosie loved being under things when she was a puppy. She would go under the chest of drawers that we showed you in Amanda's room. And she'd bark and at me like, Arr! But then she would like love curling up under things. So Amanda had the good idea one day to put her bed here and it's just so cute when she camps out in her little nook. Um, this is my little office area. The forest. People in your company are very jealous of this setup. <laughs> because I could like film you through this plant. I can quickly run through some things. Yeah. This is an Elgato Wave 3 mic, which I adore. This is like the windshield for it for like, you know, flying, right. flying and, and spits. Uh, this is a Lumix G7 hooked up to um, an Elgato Cam Link, which allows me to use that as my webcam and have like a good bokeh in the background. Obviously it's a MacBook Pro. This is a really nice Philips monitor, which has like the USB-C like adapter so it can charge it and also like be as another monitor. I love this Keychron keyboard. It's mechanical, so it makes me sound like this. And I really Much to my chagrin. <laughs> I really love that type of feeling. Um, these are the Apple Air Max headphones. They were way too expensive and I purchased them and I kind of regret it because they're okay. They're, they're, they're just okay. Um, and then these are our plants, which have grown so tremendously. This is a bird of paradise. This is this really cool, it's called African Spear. It's a Sansevera. This is a Monstera, which is out of control and we will be repotting soon because it like, look is at it. a monster. Just living it look at it. Our Billy bookshelf, complete with all of our books with this like cascading pothos. We've also managed to like transplant some of the pothos, which is really Oh, that's cute. one of my favorite mugs. This is a mug that Amanda bought me. It says, stay at home plant, dad. Yeah, this is Willow, my first D&D character. It's 
it's pretty great. What's your favorite Christmas present you've ever received? Uh, this one. This That's is right, Admiral Rosie. That's right. Yeah. Fun fact, Amanda saw like a bunch of queen outfits, princess outfits, and she said, you know what? Rosie would be a military leader in some sort of Renaissance painting. So this is Scotty's setup as a whole, literally <laughs> in a jungle, and all of his coworkers are jealous. This is where he works, and next is where he sleeps. Hmm? Oh, hi. Let's do it again, because I was out of focus. Okay. Go. Oh, hello. One thing I want to know before we get in here, Scotty, we changed every single handle in here. It used to be like an old brass, like that with those goldy handles. Scotty had a great hack and spray painted them, but they only last so long being nice. They were so scratched up and just such a faff. So we changed these. They are from the brand called Halifax, I believe. I got them at Rona. It was probably five, four to $500 to change them all in our house. I know that seems like a lot, but it makes such a huge difference. Okay, so coming into the bedroom, this is like the pride and joy of a job well done, I think, because this is kind of where it really, really all began. So I got to do this amazing collaboration with Rona, and I will link that video up above because it's done really, really well. And my dad and I installed this board and batten wall. This is in the color Sacramento green and I was inspired to make this color happen in our bedroom because of Bobby Burke from Queer Eye and Scotty and I love Queer Eye so much. The most complimentary color to a greeny blue is an orange hue. So terracotta has been pretty popular this year. So we went with terracotta and teal. Um, the one thing we haven't changed in here, which I'm really looking forward to change eventually and we do have kind of like on the, the foreseeable first up the foreseeable future to make the purchase is a brand new bed but we have made the purchase finally to do two different side tables and you'll recognize these as the same side table design as the chest of drawers in the spare room so hopefully one day they're all in the same room together below the bed we have a bunch of storage which is so great and then on the bed you'll notice this is real life right i got these be uh, beautiful terracotta sheets from indigo but this is my lily silk pillowcase because this is what i actually sleep on at night unless like i was having people over and showing them around <laughs> i'd probably change it but that really is going to help your hair so that's kind of something um other little bits just little magazine over there scott i'm literally shook that there's not five water glasses on there what's our record like five amanda is notorious for just taking multiple glasses of water too to bed. <laughs> a huge installment for our bedroom is both me and Scotty's Kobos, which my parents got us for oh Christmas gosh. last year. Like the best thing ever. These two frames are also from Ikea in the same size that you saw out there, just obviously in gold. And both of these pictures, they're from, again, decennio and opposite wall. One from each, actually. Spinning around here, I really wanted to bring in a lot of texture into this bedroom. I didn't want to be afraid of color. I wanted to really give it a go. The walls are an al are called alabaster. They're a white, but a bit of an off-white. But the curtains I got from Wayfair. And again, they weren't the cheapest things ever, but they're blackout curtains. They really help control the temperature in here during the summer and the winter. And I absolutely adore them. And then we got the double curtain rod, which is also helpful because then we can kind of open the windows, have privacy, but still let a lot of light in. Scotty, why don't we show them? I can say, it. speaking of light, yeah. weird thing about this room is it never had pot lights. None of our like rooms do. Uh, no pot lights, no like fan light, no nothing. So what I did, we can link the video, is we installed this wireless remote like smart app control dimmer. It's from Wemo. And so anyways, it controls the this yeah. string lights that we put up, which... So it's so cool. Do you want me to do that? Yeah, yeah you, do, you do that. And we can also control that on an app as well as our little side table lights there. Yeah. Um, this is my very messy closet, um, and it looks oof, real, real yellow, and now it's dark. Oh, yeah. So great. I'm sure it'll adjust. Um, that's an Ikea thing we put in there, an Ikea wardrobe, because it used to be just like a wire coat hanger. Uh, and this is a cowboy hat that I thought would look really good, and unfortunately it doesn't. <laughs> Moving on. Last but not least, our spare bedroom, the room that we did very last, the only room I didn't have any hands on until last week last two weeks so in here we completed the paint job in alabaster um on this all the walls to show off i know <laughs> sorry do you want me to move out of the way Why you just near it? okay yeah good idea okay so ooh, gotta bring this down gotta bring that down okay so this room is the last room 
that I had my hands on. These walls are in the same paint as the bedroom called Alabaster. It's also white. And I purchased these little sets, the, um, the light up here, the towel ring, the towel bar behind the door, the toilet, toilet paper roll, and there was also a robe hook, but the robe hook was very confusing and it seemed like your robe would just fall off. So we were just like, let's not put that on there. But I purchased that from Lowe's in a pack from Global Electric. I will link that down below. We replaced this tap. Um, for this room, I think what I'll do is I'll just tag, cause I feel like this video is already getting pretty long. I'll just tag the entire reno video above, but our most recent pride and joy is redoing all of the grout in here. And there's that floor once again with some little bits and bobs from HomeSense and yeah so this realm is finally completely redone and we absolutely love it. Anyways thanks for coming to our home rental tour. He's we like, really really appreciated it. Get out. You can see like a good view of the carpet now. Oh yeah. And um yeah that's it. Thanks for having us. <laughs> Take care. Um because Scotty is not the owner of this channel. I'm gonna say please like and subscribe. I hope you guys liked our little apartment tour. My parents were so kind to be literally hiding in the back the entire time um, because we're going to be doing some final renos and there's an absolutely um, huge announcement coming to the channel. We're so. not pregnant, we're not pregnant. <laughs> we say that every time. Aww. We're not pregnant. Um, yeah, there's an absolutely huge channel announcement coming very, very soon. So please do subscribe and turn on those notifications so you can be the first to know besides you. What are we doing? Bye guys. <laughs>